What if Nikola Jokic, the reigning finals MVP and two-time regular season MVP, played in the 1980s? What would happen? We're going to throw him into the 1984 NBA draft with Akeem Olajuwon, Michael Jordan, John Stockton, Barkley, and see how much success Nikola Jokic has in this era. Now, to be fair, I do believe that every great player in NBA history could play in every single era. Now, with whether or not they have as much success as far as winning championships, that depends on the team around them, right? But they would all be great no matter what. So I, I expect Nikola Jokic to be great in this era. And honestly, this era might fit Jokic better than the current one we're in. Because I feel like the game was a bit slower. It was more you know, inside and mid-range, even though Jokic can hit the three, still, like, I don't know. Maybe the 80s would have been a better era for him. But I, I don't know. I, he's he's a great player. I, I don't know. He, he's an unbelievable player, and he's one of my favorite players. If you guys didn't know, I'm a Nuggets fan, and so uh, I get to say the Denver Nuggets are NBA champions all the time. Actually, you guys can't see this, but... Uh, yeah, it's so awesome. <laughs> it is so awesome that uh, I, I get to say that now. I still can't believe it. I really can't. Anyways, let's get on to the video. Simulate uh, this first year and uh, see where Nikola Jokic gets drafted. All right, real quick, because none of this will really matter. But Magic Johnson wins MVP, Ralph Sampson, Rookie of the Year, Sixth Man of the Year, Kevin McHale. Artist Gilmore, DPOY, Most Improved is Dominique. There is your All-NBA First Team, and we'll go ahead and simulate through the playoffs here as I'm the Denver Nuggets right now waiting for, you know, the team to pick because we don't know where Jokic is going. The Boston Celtics win the finals. Larry Bird wins finals MVP 34, 8, and 6, which is actually, funny enough, one of the players that a lot of people uh, compare Jokic to. Uh, like, I know Popovich has compared Jokic to Larry Bird, so... Um, yeah, I just I I think that's really interesting. Obviously, I didn't get to watch Larry Bird. I've seen highlights and stuff, but yeah, I mean they they have similar gameplay styles. I don't know. I just think that's interesting. The Bulls and the Bullets have the are doing the coin flip here, and the Bullets win the coin flip, so it will go Bullets, Bulls, Rockets, Kings, Sixers via the Clippers, the Pacers via the Knicks, Clippers via Golden State, Hawks. And the Blazers via Indy and Mavs at 10 via Cleveland. So, unfortunately... Oh, did Denver ne never even had their pick? Well, that's sad. He won't be a nugget. That's that's honestly devastating to think that he could have not been a nugget. That really hurts. Anyways, if you guys are enjoying this video and wanting to see more, hit that like button. Subscribe if you guys are new. We're so close to 5,000. Might actually hit 5,000 by the time this video goes up. So thank you for 5,000 subscribers. And comment down below what other simulations, rebuilds, anything like that here on 2K24 you guys want to see. I need some ideas. So uh, give me some ideas in the comments below. But here we go. The first overall pick in the 1984 NBA draft goes to Michael Jordan. Man, the Bulls were this close. They were this close. With the second overall pick, the uh, Chicago Bulls take Akeem Olajuwon. Didn't think Jokic would be a top two pick, but he might be a top three pick based on kind of where it... No, Barkley is a third overall pick by the Houston Rockets, which happened in real life, right? Yeah, he got drafted by Houston, right? No. Yes? No, Phoenix. Or was it Philly? No, it wasn't Houston. He played Houston later on in his career. My bad. Was he drafted by Phoenix or Philly? I can't remember. It, you know what? No, it was Philly. It was Philly. I think. I, I don't know why I can't remember all of a sudden. With the fourth overall pick, the Kansas City Kings take John Stockton over Nikola Jokic. And the Philadelphia 70s... This is hilarious. This is honestly hilarious. Nikola Jokic gets drafted by the Philadelphia 76ers. That's funny. That's actually that's actually really funny. And honestly, the most perfect thing that could have happened, other than him going to the Nuggets, is him going to the Sixers. You know, the center that they wish they had. But, you know, their, their current one can't do what Jokic can do. But anyways, moving on. Uh, Jokic is the fifth overall pick here. We'll see how it goes in his career in a Philly. 
Maybe, uh, maybe he'll win Philly something. I guess Philly could use it. All right, let's take a look at this uh, Sixers roster here. You got Moses Malone at center. So I'm not sure when Jokic is going to play. This is a good team. With Jokic on this team, a lot of bigs. You got Bobby Jones at power forward. I, I doubt Jokic will start. We could look at the game plan here. Yeah, he's not going to start, but he will be getting 28 minutes a game. So we'll see how it goes for Jokic's rookie year. And uh, yeah, I mean, does anyone, is anyone wearing number 15? Because I kind of want to give him number 15. Is it retired? Number 15 might be retired from Philly. Oh, is that? Yeah, you know what? I think it's retired. Let's see here. Uh, jersey number 14. Yeah, it's retired. Um, hmm. Okay. You know what? Let's give him number 21. The 84-85 season is now over. Magic Johnson wins MVP. Michael Jordan wins Rookie of the Year, 26-4-5 with two steals and a block. Nikola Jokic, Sixth Man of the Year! Yeah! 15-6-6, six six, shooting 47% from the field, 74% from the free throw line, and 32% from three. That's awesome! Sixth Man of the Year, all right. Akeem wins the DPOY. Most improved is James Worthy. And uh, there's the All-NBA first team. Jordan makes the second team. And on the All-Defensive team, Jordan makes it again. And All-Rookie first team, Jokic does make the All-Rookie first, first team. Akeem Olajuwon averaged 21 10, and 10. Stockton averaged 11 and 9. And Barkley averaged 14, 9, and 2 assists per game. So those are the rookies there. And for the Sixers, we are the three seed. Okay. All right, it's because Jokic. That that's that's the only reason, and you know, not because they have Maurice Cheeks, Dr. J, Bobby Jones, Moses Malone, and all those guys. It's it's this guy wearing number twenty one, doing what another twenty one can't do for them. You know, you know. I just almost choked on my own spit. All right, Philly sweeps Milwaukee three zero. Now we've got the Detroit Pistons with Isaiah. Benny Johnson, Chapuka, Cliff Levinston, Bill Lambeer. It's a good squad. Uh, let's see. Any other rookies, by the way, making it? Uh, I don't think... I don't really remember here. Let's see. Boston obviously doesn't have anyone. New Jersey, no. So, yeah. Out of the top five, at least, Jokic made it the farthest his rookie year. Not bad. All right. Now, we win... And five against the Detroit Pistons and taking the Sixers where Joel Embiid could never take them to the conference finals. All right. I, I should stop, but it's really funny. Okay. Anyways, uh, on to the Eastern Conference Finals where we play the number one seeded Boston Celtics, the Lakers and the Blazers on the other side. Let's see what happens here. Come on, Philly. Oh my gosh. We are on to the NBA Finals in year one. That's insane. Okay, it's the Lakers and the Sixers. This is going to be a tough series. Got Magic, Cooper, Wilkes, Worthy, and Kareem. That team's insane. Let's see how Jokic is doing. Obviously, as a six man in the playoffs, getting better like he usually does. 17, 5, and 7. I won't say it. I won't say it. But you guys know, you guys know what I'm thinking. All right. Anyways. Game number one, the Lakers win that one. Game two, Philly wins game two. All right. The Lakers win game three. Philly wins game four. On to game five, LA wins. And the Lakers will win an NBA championship. They beat the 76ers. Jokic's rookie year, he gets to the finals. Can't quite win it, but he ran into Magic. I mean, Magic's insane. 21, 8, and 12 in the NBA finals. He wins finals MVP. The 1985 NBA draft is complete. Patrick Ewing goes number one. And for the Sixers, they draft Gerald Wilkins. Six foot six guard, small forward guard, whatever. So we'll see if uh, if he can really help out Jokic in this squad. I'm assuming Jokic is going to be coming off the bench once again. We'll see. Well, let's take a look at this roster and see what they do this year. Can we get back to the NBA Finals and win a championship? Year two, Moses is still a 94. 
Dr. J is an 86. Cheeks is an 84. Jokic is now an 84 overall. So getting better. Just 19 years old. His age, I think, was a little off. Because, uh, yeah, he didn't come into the league until technically 20, I think. Um, maybe I'm wrong. But I think that's right. Right around there. But anyways, he's at an 84. He's the fourth best player. And potentially could start at the four. We could move... Actually, you know what? Let's do this. Let's move Moses to the power forward so Jokic can uh, can start. I think that's better anyways because he's 6'10". Um, so yeah, I think that works out. So Jokic will be a starter this year. Let's see what happens. The 85-86 season is now over. Magic wins MVP. 24, 9, and 13. Nearly a triple-double. Karl Malone wins Rookie of the Year. Byron Scott, Sixth Man of the Year. DPOY is Akeem Olajuwon. Most improved player, Nikola Jokic. We're going to get every... He's got six man. Okay, well, he probably won't deep win DPOY. But six man and most improved already. He, all he needs is DPOY. And, well, I guess he didn't win rookie of the year. But DPOY and most improved. Or what? Most improved? MVP. Guys, I can't speak English. I'm struggling over here. 17.5 points per game. Nearly eight boards and nine assists in year two. Shot 51-44. That's pretty good. That's really good. Uh, let's see. All NBA first teams. Magic, MJ, Bird, Kellogg, and Akeem Olajuwon. Uh, Jokic made the all NBA third team here in year number two. Averaging 17, 8, and 9. Pretty damn good. Uh, didn't make an all defensive team though. And on to the playoffs in the, in the 76ers of the one seed. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. This team is really good. I, I think we can win it this year. I think we can win it. Let's see what happens. We sweep Atlanta 3-0. On to round two against the Celtics. And we beat them in five. Now we've got the New Jersey Nets. And we sweep them. Oh, this team is insane. We got the Lakers for a second straight year. Can we win it this time around? Let's look at the uh, let's look at the starting lineups here. You got Cheeks versus Magic. Campbell versus Cooper. Dr. J versus Wilkes, Moses versus Worthy, and Jokic versus Kareem. <laughs> That's awesome. That is awesome. All right. Let's see what happens. We'll go into game one. Philly wins game one. Game two, the Lakers win. Game three, the Lakers win. Game four, Philly wins. On to game five, the Lakers win. All right. Let's jump in the Simcast here. Can a Philly force a game seven here? They are at home. But the Lakers with the lead here, and they're up by 17. Oh, no. Ugh. We're going to jump to 0-2 in the NBA Finals. This damn Lakers team. I hate. I hate. We beat them in the Conference Finals. We beat them in the Conference Finals. They stink. They got swept. 4-0. And we won the championship. Okay? All right. We're good. Magic only averaged 13 a game. What the hell? Nine boards, 10 assists. And the Lakers went back to back there. And uh, yeah, that sucks. But hey, MB can't do that. The Sixers in the 1986 draft take Buck Johnson, another small forward for the team. So we'll see how that works out. The problem here is like Dr. J is going to retire. Moses is going to get older. So like, yeah, um, it might the, his career might start off with a lot of winning, but it might tail off uh with the winning at least because those guys retire but then he's too good to get them to stink to where they can get high draft picks might be a weird situation so that's why like winning a championship would be awesome here early on but Jokic just isn't good enough just yet i mean he was only in what an 85 overall or whatever so yeah he needs to get a little bit better hopefully a big jump this year let's go to player progression and see he's up to an 87 overall this year moses is still a 94 but dr j is down to an 83 this might be their last chance here to win. Like, they're... I don't know, man. This is going to be tough. Gerald Wilkins is up to his 76. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Jokic makes his first All-Star game. He puts up 15-3-4. and four, And the East wins it 112-102. So, that's pretty cool. Played 14 minutes and was really good. The 86-87 season is now over. Jordan wins MVP, 26-4-6, two steals a game. Mark Price, Rookie of the Year, Six Man of the Year is Jay Humphreys. Akeem wins at DPOY. 
and most improved is Terry Porter. Jordan on the All-NBA first team with Magic, Bird, Malone, and Akeem Olajuwon. Second team has Isaiah Thomas, Alex English, Dominique, Moses Malone, and fellow teammate Nikola Jokic averaging 20 point, 22 points, 9 boards, 8.6 assists per game at an 89 overall, shooting 50, 40, and nearly 78% from the free throw line. Man, Moses had a great year too. Look at that, 23 and 14. That's why Nikola's not getting as much rebounds. That's a hell of a big man duo. That is awesome. No other Sixers here. All defensive first team, Moses is on that team. Pretty cool. And then all rookie, no, none of our guys were on the all rookie team. So we are the, ooh, we're the four seed this year. Not great. Washington's the one seed with MJ. Oh my God, and Magic, are you kidding me? Oh, you've got to be kidding me, dude. The Lakers lost Magic and Kareem in the offseason. And I was like, okay, might have a chance here. Nope. <laughs> he goes and joins Michael Jordan. Unbelievable. We sweep Boston. Man, Boston just cannot get past us. 3-0, and now we play Washington. Unbelievable. Oh, whoa. We just swept Washington. Let's go. All right. Well, now we got Detroit with Isaiah. Same team as uh, the, the team we played a couple of years ago. We should beat them. And we do. We win in six. And we now play the Golden State Warriors, who have Sleepy Floyd, Jim Paxson, Purvis Short, uh, Pickney, and William Bet. We should. We should absolutely crush them. We win game one. Okay. Warriors win game two. We win game three. Warriors win game four. We win game five. Here we go. Can we win game six in Golden State for the first time winning a title with Nikola Jokic? Here we go. Can we do it? Three and a half minutes go. It's a close game, actually. Ooh. You know what? Let's watch the last, last minute. A minute to go, and that jump shot is no good. Rebound goes down to Bobby Jones. Jokic is in the game. Cheeks will have it now. Over to Dr. J. Gets it in post to Nikola Jokic. Jokic in the post. Hook shot. Oh, he missed it. Bobby Jones couldn't grab the rebound. Floyd out on the break. Warriors down by two. Floyd passing to Kellogg. Puts it in. All right. We're tied at 100. 39 seconds to go. Come on, Jokic. Hit a game winner to win your first championship. First three years in the league. He's, in, he's playing in the NBA Finals. Ball back to Jokic. Jokic in the post. Up and under. That's no good. Oh, no. What is happening? Come on, Jokic. This is a disaster. Paxson. Thought he was going to shoot that three. Gets it over to Floyd. Floyd drives. Drives right. Back left. Floyd was going to put it up, didn't it? Now to, over to Bedford to Short. Three seconds on the clock. Short puts up a three. That's no good. Rebound down to Clark, Clark Kellogg. He misses it. Jokic with the rebound. Big rebound from Nikola Jokic. Two seconds to go. Philly calls a timeout. Could you imagine if Jokic had a game winner here? I would fall off my chair. Here we go. Two seconds to go. Get it to Yoke. Come on. Ball is. It was open. Cheeks. Oh, he missed it. All right, we're going to go to overtime. Back in the SimCast here. We'll go down to another minute. Actually, no. Let's go down to like, oh, nine seconds. I stopped it too late. What just happened? Was it Yoke? No, it was Dr. J who uh, makes uh, the jumper to give him a two-point lead. All right, let's jump in with nine seconds to go and see what happens. Golden State with possession, obviously. Down by two. Can they tie it? Floyd with it. Gets a screen. Four seconds on the clock. Floyd over to Kellogg. Jumper is good! What a shot from Clark Kellogg! One second to go. We don't know the exact amount of time. I don't know if they have time to uh, shoot a jumper. It doesn't look like... Well, no, that just says 0-1. That, sh that says one second. Jokic will pass it in. Ball into Cheeks. Oh, he almost hit that. Goodness. We got double overtime. 
That will do it. The Warriors pull away in overtime, in double overtime. They win at 125 to 120. Jokic had 31, 20, and 10. Good Lord. Oh, my. He had a great game. Wasn't quite enough. Moses Malone, 30 and 19. Cheeks only had 16 on 8 of 18 shooting, 12 assists. Dr. J had 16, 9, and 7. But it wasn't enough as we will head on to, what, Game 7 in, in Philly. Here we go. Game 7. Back to Philly we go. Up by 10 after 1. Up by, what is that, 13 at the half. The Warriors trying to come back, though. Uh, they're okay. Philly's only up by six here. 352 to go, and we're pulling away. That's gonna do it. Nice. All right, let's um, I think I want to jump in here and just watch the celebration. And that will do it. The 76ers are NBA champions. They win at 125 to 111 over the Warriors in game number seven. And after Losing two straight years to the Los Angeles Lakers in the finals. Nikola Jokic and the 76ers are NBA champions. Uh, it's so funny. It is so funny that, <laughs> that he plays for the Sixers. Well, watch the celebration. I know in the last video I posted um, just showing off the my, my, my eras or my NBA eras, whatever it's called. And uh, we never watched a uh, championship celebration for the... Uh, for this era to see if anything's you know new or different so we'll check it out if you guys missed that video go check it out uh we just kind of had some fun checking out the 2010s era and, and some other eras and see what's new but anyways we'll hoist up the larry o'brien trophy looks like the older trophy which is good i don't think they had it like that last year and nikola Jokic wins finals mvp in year three 20 years old that is awesome that is awesome he went to a great situation but uh yeah that's hilarious in game seven he had 16 8 and 13. i mean everyone played great it was a it was a blowout in the end but let's see his uh finals mvp numbers as he averaged 25 12 and 9. 55% from the field. Only shot 25% from three. But still, a great series from him. And uh, Nikola Jokic. Finals MVP already. Oh, Dr. J retires. All right. We'll see if we can keep winning without Dr. J. But uh, yeah, that's going to be interesting how this team transitions onto, you know, the Jokic era. Can we keep winning without, you know, Dr. J and Moses Malone down the road, right? Uh, we'll see what happens. We draft Muggsy Bogues with the last pick in uh, the uh, first round. So we get a point guard. He's a 76 overall. I mean, it's not a bad pick as David Robinson went one. Scotty went two to the Spurs. So we'll see what happens. Player progression here. Moses goes down by one overall. Jokic goes up to uh, a 90 overall. Murray Sheeks is up to an 85 Wilkins is up to a 78. Bobby Jones is down to a 78. So a lot of guys getting worse. Obviously, Dr. J not on the team anymore. Doesn't look like we signed anyone. So, yeah, I don't know. This year's going to be tough. Jokic is really going to have to have an amazing year. All right, here in the 1988 NBA Awards, Michael Jordan wins MVP again. 31, 5, and 8. Doesn't have a finals MVP, though. Doesn't have one of those. David Robinson, Rookie of the Year. Clark Kellogg, Sixth Man of the Year. DPOY is Akeem Olajuwon. Terry Porter wins the Most Improved. Uh, Jokic still not on the All-NBA First Team. Man, they these Washington... Uh, I can't believe they got Magic, too. That's so annoying. He's 28, too. Like, good Lord. That's ridiculous. That team's insane. All right. Anyways, uh, Jokic not on the second team, but did make it to the third team. He had a better year than last year. 24, 10, and 9. Nearly a triple-double. Shot 49% from the field. 37% from three. Another really good year. He's at a 91 overall now. And we are the three seed. So let's see how the playoffs go this year. We've made it to the finals three straight years. Now we play the Bulls. We have Mark Price, Theus, Shrimp, Greenwood, and Akeem Olajuwon. So Akeem versus Jokic. This one's going to be interesting. Philly wins game one. 
We win game two. We win game three. And uh, we win in five. So never mind. That wasn't too hard. But now we got Magic and Jordan. And what the hell? They have James Worthy too? What was the record? Where, where does it show their record? Does it show their record in here? 59 and 23. They lost 23 games with those three? This is ridiculous. All this, you know that meme? All of this to beat one man. <laughs> All of this to beat... Where is he? Where is he? This guy. This guy who can't jump over a curb. All that to beat him. Unbelievable. All right. We'll simulate the round here. Yeah, we lose. Stunned. Can't believe it. Unbelievable. They better win a championship. Magic. Ha! Ah, suck it, Jordan. Magic wins finals MVP. 26.8 points per game, six boards, and 12 assists. And there's that year. That sucked. Malone goes down one overall. Jokic goes, uh, I think he was a 91 last year, wasn't he? Or maybe he was a 90 and he was just getting like a plus one bonus. I don't know. No, it says 91 overall there in the left. I don't know what's going on. It's, eh, he's a 90 overall. He didn't move up, didn't move down. Uh, Cheeks is down to an 84. Wilkins up to an 80. Bogues is up three to 79. So hopefully he turns into a really good player or maybe Wilkins. I don't know. Ah, man, this team is just, they got old. They lost Dr. J. We're not good enough. Not, not good enough to beat that stupid Washington team so dumb anyways i wanted to look at the badges that Jokic has i'm curious so let's go ahead and see here where wait did i pass it oh it's right here anyways hall of fame dimer hall of fame needle threader hall of fame post playmaker gold aerial wizard okay gold break starter gold comeback kid gold guard up gold limitless damn silver blinders box out brick wall catch and shoot corner specialist dream shaker uh drop stepper Masher, post fade, phenom, that should be Hall of Fame. Uh, silver, post spin, technician, silver, special delivery, bronze, claymore, dead eye, giant slayer, and workhorse. So, those are all of his, uh, all of his badges at 22 years old. On to the 1989 NBA Awards. Magic wins MVP after winning Finals MVP. Danny Manning wins Rookie of the Year. Clark Kellogg wins Sixth Man of the Year. DPOY is Akeem again. Mark Jackson most improved. Nikola Jokic is on the All NBA First Team this year which is pretty cool. And let's go to his numbers here. 28, 10, and 8. So taking more of a scoring load, shot 50, 40, and nearly 80% from the free throw line. So a good year from him, Magic and, and Jordan, still on the All-NBA first team together as teammates. So dumb. Moses Malone on the second team, averaging 25 and 12. Imagine when Moses Malone is gone. The like Jokic is going to be unreal. He's going to be insane. It's gonna be crazy. Anyways, we are the four seed. So we got the Celtics again and we get swept by the Celtics. Yeah, I mean, I, the rest of the guys around Jokic are just getting older. It kind of sucks. And meanwhile, uh, Jordan and the freaking Bullets are gonna roll over everyone. Yep, they sweep in the finals. Michael Jordan wins his first finals MVP average 38, five and five, 2.8 steals and 2.3 blocks. Damn. Yeah, that's a good team. Looking at the roster now, Jokic is up to a 91 overall. Moses is down to an 89. Cheeks is down to an 82. Bogues is up to an 81. Wilkins is at an 80. So, yeah. They have Jeff Turner, Don Erickson, Ricky Brown. Ah, uh, just, um, yeah, this team is gonna, this team is not gonna be very good this year. I'm glad we won one championship and went to three finals because... This team got old and uh, bad really quick. On to the 1990 NBA Awards, and Nikola Jokic wins MVP. 29.7 points per game, 9.6 rebounds, 8 assists, 1 steal, and 1 block. I wonder if he had to beg for the MVP award. Uh, anyways, uh, Rookie of the Year, Tim Hardaway. Clark Kellogg wins another 6th Man of the Year. Akeem Olajuwon wins DPOY. BJ Maxwell wins Most Improved. Jokic obviously on, on the All-NBA First Team. Ooh, Magic left the bullets. Thank God. He went to Minnesota. Jordan still averaged 29, 5, and 6. And on to the playoffs. I forgot to look at the other stuff, but that's all right. 
But as a one seed, Jokic got this team, uh, let's see, how many wins as a one seed? Let's see, he got um, to 49, wow, only, only took 49 wins to get the one seed. Jeez. All right. Well, we uh, beat Boston 3-1. Now we've got the New Jersey Nets, and we beat them 4-1. And the seven-seeded Milwaukee Bucks are in the conference finals with Doc Rivers, Tony Campbell, Jamal Wilkes. Kojin Murphy, I think that's an auto-generated player. And then David Robinson. Ooh, David Robinson versus Jokic. See what happens. And we sweep them. That was easy. Now we've got the Houston Rockets. So you got Barkley and Malone on the same team. You got Larry Drew on that team. Del Curry's on that team. Averaging 17 points per game. All right. We're back to the NBA Finals. I'm kind of stunned, honestly. I really didn't think we'd make it to the NBA Finals this year. Well, that's why. Jokic is averaging 34, 12, and 10 in the in the playoffs. That's shooting 50% from, from three. That, that's that's pretty that's 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 pretty good. That's pretty good. We win game one, we win game two, we win game three, and we sweep them. Nikola Jokic wins his second finals MVP. 26, 13, and 12 in the finals. Shot 80, 40, or what? 50, 40, 87. Good lord, had two steals a game too. Okay, well, he's 2-2 two and two in the finals now. And uh, has made the finals four of his five years. Or wait, no. One, two, three, four, five, six. Four times in six years. That's pretty good. Nikola Jokic is now up to a 94 overall. So a big jump thereafter. Kind of small jumps. I think he went plus one the last two years. Now plus three. Malone, though, is down to an 88. And ooh, we lost... Let's see. No, Cheeks is just down to an 80. That sucks. David Robinson wins MVP here in 1991. 25, 13, and 5 per game. Pretty good year. Derek Coleman wins Rookie of the Year. Ralph Kerr wins Sixth Man of the Year. Akeem Elijah wins DPOY. Uh, Blue Edwards wins Most Improved. Ooh, uh, okay. So no Jokic on the All-NBA first team. No Jordan either. Uh, they're both on the second team, though. Jordan, let's see what Jordan averaged. 24, 4, and 5. Jokic averaged 28, nearly 10 rebounds, 6.8 assists. So his numbers did jump, uh, drop. So definitely not an MVP year. All NBA third team. Uh, James, did Worthy go back to the Lakers? What a bizarre, what is happening? I, I'm just, yeah, I'm, I'm not confused. Just weird simulation. Uh, I don't know. Oh my God, we didn't even make the playoffs. Well, all right. We got old. <laughs> I mean, Jokic is still good, but no one else is. Hey, the Knicks won. That's weird. Uh, Dominique wins finals MVP. 30 points per game at 6.8 rebounds in the NBA finals. They beat the Golden State Warriors. And uh, we'll see what happens this offseason. Jokic moves up to a 95. Moses went down four to an 84 overall. Yeah, this team, this team's not good. I mean, Jokic is great. But they've got to they've got to get a free agent or somebody, or else he might just leave. I mean, he does have three years on that contract, so it's gonna be a little bit before he can leave, <laughs> making four million dollars a year. Yeah, it's a little different in the modern era, huh? Um, <laughs> that's hilarious. But uh, yeah, I don't know. This team they're gonna have to do something in free agency because that's not a good team. Ooh, on to the next era. Wow, that was quick. We're on to the 1990s, the Jordan era. I, I love that uh, that animation screen, whatever. The Jordan era, obviously, the Raptors Grizzlies joining, the G League starting, and uh, a lot of rule changes as well. So we'll see how Jokic adjusts to those rules. Magic wins another MVP, this time with the Minnesota Timberwolves. Six-time champ, five-time MVP, five-time finals MVP. Pretty good. Pretty good career for Magic. Billy Owens wins Rookie of the Year. John Williams wins Six Man. Akeem wins another DPOY. Uh, Jokic is on the All-NBA First Team this year. Two-time champion, one-time MVP, two-time Finals MVP, six-time All-Star, three-time First Team All-NBA, two-time Second Team All-NBA at just 26 years old. That's pretty good for 26 years old. Uh, nearly 30 points per game this year, 10 boards and 7.6 assists. Now, you're, we're going to start seeing his rebounds go up because of uh, Malone going down in overall. So uh, yeah, all NBA first team though for Jokic. 
no one else on the second or third team and no one on the uh, all defensive teams we have made the playoffs this year as a three seed but like everyone's overall is just way down that uh, that sucks all right well let's see how far we can get this year we sweep orlando now we've got the seven seeded chicago bulls we beat them in five and we're back to the conference finals now we play the milwaukee bucks who uh david robinson is on this team 23 and 11 and 5 in the west it's minnesota and sacramento so we may have to go through uh what's his face uh magic johnson if we make it to the to the nba finals we win game one we lose game two milwaukee wins game three as well we tie it at two they win game five though that's a big game Ooh, okay we tie it up at six and we lose ah all right, yeah, I and mean, we're just not good enough. Jokic is carrying. We're just not quite good enough. Chris Mullen wins uh, Finals MVP, 25 and 5 per game as the Kings win the NBA Finals. Interesting. All right, I want. I'm curious to see what Jokic did in the playoffs. 28, 8, and 7. Okay, not great. His game seven only had three rebounds and four assists. Kind of bizarre. I guess it was a higher scoring game. That's uh, that's an odd one. Jokic is at a 95 still, and we got Xavier McDaniel. He's 29 years old. He went down 2 overall. Great signing, guys. That's that's terrific. Uh, Muggsy still on the on the team. Oh, Steve Smith was a rookie last year. He's up to an 80 overall. We got Lister, Mahorn, Maurice Cheeks. Uh, Moses is gone. He didn't retire. I don't think. Uh, he shouldn't have. I didn't see him in the Hall of Fame. Yeah, no. He didn't retire, so Moses Malone left. All right. Here in 1993, Jokic wins MVP again. 32, 10, and 8. That's a pretty damn good season. Uh, that's, that's a really good season. 50, 40, 90 as well. Shaq wins Rookie of the Year. He got drafted by Seattle. By the way, Magic went to Seattle, I'm pretty sure. So it's Magic and Shaq. On that Seattle team, which is pretty insane. Yeah, he went to Seattle. Average 25, 7, and 10. Jokic on the All-NBA first team once again. Uh, Sean Kemp is on the Nuggets. And no other Sixers made it on an All-NBA team. And no one made it on an All-Defensive team. No All-Rookies either. Uh, we are the four seed. So let's see how things go uh, this year. And we lost in round one. Well, that's... That's unfortunate. The Knicks lost as a one seed. And the Bucks win the NBA championship this year. David Robinson wins a finals MVP. Jokic goes up to a 96. Steve Smith is up to an 84. Steve Smith could potentially, if he can get really good, that could be a heck of a duo for us. But other than that, this team isn't very good. Like, we're getting to the playoffs because Jokic is just insane. But we're just we're not a good team i mean everyone got old so that's what happens right when you get drafted by a really good team and uh you know by the time you hit your prime your your team is old and uh they've all kind of moved on so 27 years old 96 overall he's he's amazing he just won mvp but it might be another rough year oh michael jordan went to the lakers all right oh he's been there for three years Missed that. Uh, 31, 6, and 7. He wins MVP. Chris Webber wins Rookie of the Year. John Williams wins Sixth Man of the Year. DPOY is Akeem again. Jokic did not make the All-NBA first or second team. Or third. Wow, he didn't make an All-NBA team. Oh, that's... That's kind of disappointing. Did we even make the playoffs? Uh, we are. We're the, whoa, we're the two seed. Interesting. He's a 97 overall. Average 25, 10, and 6. Somehow that wasn't good enough. To make an all-NBA team. There is a lot of good centers in this era. So I kind of get it. Um, but Steve Smith is looking pretty good. 19 a game. Xavier McDaniel. You got Charles Smith. All right. They're 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 rebuilding. It's not bad. We'll, we'll see if we can win another championship here. Remember, we've made it to the finals four times. We've won two times. And we're on to the conference finals. Now we play the Bucks, who have David Robinson. They beat us last time. We were in the conference finals and they beat us again. 
They come back from 3-1. That's that's rough. That's that's pretty rough. And Michael Jordan wins another finals MVP. 33-6-9. and nine. And how many championships is that for Jordan? That's three. So he has a he has passed Jokic for the most in their draft class. But they have the same amount of finals MVPs. He does have one more regular season MVP though. So yeah, Jordan, uh, Jordan in this sim is really good, which he usually isn't in simulations and like these type of simulations. So maybe that's fixed this year, which would be really cool. Cause he's like, he's never ever very like good in these simulations. So I'm excited for the 1949 simulation when we get to that. Moses Malone retires. He finished his career. Where did he go? Uh, he went to Indy for his last year or his last. Well, I guess he played one more year and then didn't play. Maybe it was a free agent or something. Then he get picked up. But 23 and 13 for his career, three time MVP and a three time champion. Jokic is at a 96 at 28 years old. Steve Smith, Bose. I mean, no one went up. McDaniel went down three. Uh, Doug Christie went up two. So not much of a change. What in the world? <laughs> Jordan went to the Bulls. You just won a championship with the Lakers. What are you doing? Oh my God. All right. It's okay. Well, sure. Uh, Jordan wins another MVP this time in Chicago. Uh, Jason Kidd wins rookie of the year. John Williams wins six man of the year. DPY is Akeem. Oh my God. He joined Akeem. This is so dumb. Jokic is on the all NBA first team, 25, 10, and 8. Yeah. Jordan getting. Ooh, the Nuggets are the one seed. Look at that. Oh, David Robinson and Sean Kemp are now on the same team. Interesting. We're the uh two seed, but we're not beating Chicago. Jordan got like the luckiest teammates ever. Like, this is, I mean, to be fair, we got lucky teammates too with Jokic, but like still, that's insane. We play them in the conference finals. It's not going to go well. Oh, we win game one. We lose game two. We lose game three. Oh, okay. We tied at two. We lose game five. And we lose in six. Damn it. Oh, ah, suck it. They lost in five to the Warriors. Winston Garland wins finals MVP. Yeah, Jordan stinks. All right. On to the offseason. Let's see if there's any. Oh, okay. Larry Bird retires. So. There's a big one. Marcus Johnson retires as well. Kevin McHale, Rick Mahorn. Jokic is up to a 97 overall at 29 years old. Still got Muggsy on the team. Byron Scott's now on the team. Charles Smith. Uh, Arvita Sabonis is now on the team. That's pretty cool that he's on the team with Jokic. Uh, you got Christy, McDaniel, McKee. Again, not a very good team. Don't think we'll get very far. But uh, yeah, Jokic is... Uh, uh, two-way diamond, three-level score. That's a cool-ass name. I doubt you can make that in the builder, but that is awesome. David Robinson wins another MVP here in 1996. And uh, how many is that for him now? He has two and, uh, and a championship. So good year for David Robinson. Rookie of the year is Kevin Garnett. John Williams, sixth man of the year. DPOY is David Robinson as well. He's on the All-NBA first team with Sean Kemp. Ooh, Denver is really good. This year, Magic is still playing. He's now in Portland. He's gone to so many teams. It's, it's insane. Second team, Jokic is there. 26.7 points per game. 11 boards, 7 assists. 50, uh, 50, 40, 90 again. He's had three 50, 40, 90 years. Or no, two. Sorry, two. But still, pretty good. Uh, no other sixer on any of these teams. And we are once again the two seed. Man, he is absolutely carrying this team because this team isn't very good. But they're good enough to get the two seed every year. We play the Bulls now where it's a Jordan, Akeem, got Mark Price, Dennis Scott. This team is so good. I don't, I don't think we can beat them. We're down 1-0. We're down 2-0. We're down 3-0. And we get swept. That team's ridiculous, man. They win the finals. Jordan wins another one, averaging 35-99. He's insane in this. He's really good. Jokic stays out of 97 overall. Uh, I mean, this team of Bose, Manning, Scott, Arvidas. It's, 
It's just not good, uh, good enough. Jokic is just incredible and is carrying the hell out of this team. But I don't think he's going to win another championship. I really don't. I mean, we can look at his contract here. Two years left. So maybe he leaves and finds someone uh, as, a, you know, finds another star to team up with and maybe they'll win. Who knows? The 97 season is over. David Robinson wins MVP. Allen Iverson wins Rookie of the Year. John Williams wins Sixth Man of the Year. And Akeem Olajuwon wins DPOY. No Jokic on the first team, but he's on the second team. Averaging 27, 10, and 7. He's 31 years old. And uh, he's, been, he's been dominant his whole career. As a career so far, 13 years in. 25 a game and nearly 10 rebounds per game and 7.8 assists, shooting 50, 40, 84. That's pretty good. Pretty good. All right. Moving on to the playoffs. Denver is actually the one seed, but we are the two seed. And we'll take a look at this roster to make sure we're all good here. Muggsy Bogues, Byron Scott, Doug Christie, Danny Manning, and Jokic. It's a bonus coming off the bench. So let's see if we can get past the Orlando Magic. And we do in three. And then now the Miami Heat with Kenny Anderson, uh, Muhammad Abdul Rauf, Nick Anderson. All right. I mean, we should be able to beat them. This shouldn't be too bad. Yeah, we sweep them pretty easily. Now we've got this damn team with Michael Jordan and Akeem Elijah. Michael is only a 94. Wow. Okay. Akeem's a 92. Can we beat them? Please. We win game one. Okay. We lose game two. We win game three. Can we go up 3-1? We do. Come on. Oh, 3-2. Win it at home in game six. We do. All right. Now on to the NBA Finals. Yes. We've got Nuggets versus Sixers on the Nuggets team currently. Tony Dell, Kendall Gill, Jamal Mashburn, Sean Kemp, and David Robinson. These two leading this team. That's a pretty good duo uh, with the bigs there. Game one goes to Denver. Game two goes to Denver. Game three goes to Philly. Game four goes to Philly. All right. Game five. This is a big one. We win it. We're up 3-2. Can we win another NBA championship? Denver has an early lead here in game number six, and we're at home. Not good, but we're coming back. Kind of. Nah, this, that's, that's going to do it. We're going to lose game six. 135 to 106. Not good. And now we're on to game seven. Can we win another championship on the road? We have the lead. Up by 12 now in the third quarter. Into the fourth. Five minutes ago, we're up by 16. And that will do it. We're going to win it. 101 to 86. And we are NBA champions again. Nikola Jokic with another finals MVP. 27, 8, and 6 in the NBA finals. I mean, he's... He's unbelievable. How many uh, finals MVPs is that now? That is now three. Three championships for Nikola Jokic, and he's only 31 years old. That's, that's, that's pretty good. Tim Duncan now in the league. He goes number one to the Indiana Pacers. McGrady goes to the Wizards. Chauncey to the Celtics. Uh, let's see who we picked up here. We got Ricky Leonard. All right. Fantastic. On to... Free agency we'll see what this team looks like this upcoming season Jokic is still at a 97 Bogues is at an 82 Manning goes down one Scott goes down two Christie goes up one Michael Smith goes up two yeah I don't know I I mean we won it last year with basically the same team so we might be able to win it again but it's just it's not a great roster we just have Jokic 98 season is now over. Chris Webber wins MVP, 28, 14, and 5 per game. John Williams wins Sixth Man of the Year. David Robinson, another Defensive Player of the Year. Kevin Garnett winning at Most Improved. Jokic is on the All-NBA First Team once again. That's his sixth time on the first team, uh, four times on the second team. And this season averaging 27, 11, and and seven that should put him over 10 rebounds a game yeah that puts him at 10 rebounds a game for his career and we'll move on to the playoffs we are once again the number two seed and we go ahead and lose in round one well 
That did not go according to plan. And the Bulls win another championship. Gary Payton's on the team. And he won finals MVP. 26 and 10. Did Jordan leave? I wonder if Jordan left. Let's see. Let's look at this roster. Uh Oh, he did. Okay, so now it's Gary Payton. Who uh, left Charlotte to join Chicago. And Akeem Olajuwon is still there. So they get it done without Michael Jordan. Seattle got to the finals with Shaq, but couldn't get the win. Magic Johnson also retires. He finished as an 18-time All-Star, 5-time MVP, 6-time champion, 5-time finals MVP, 14-time All-NBA first team. So, yeah, he, uh, he won quite a bit, especially against us. And let's see, when we were... Yeah, he won all his championships during the Jokic era, basically. So... I mean, we, let's see, Jokic has, what, three? Magic has five, so obviously Magic definitely better than Jokic in, in this uh, in this era. Although, yeah, five MVPs too. Actually, no, sorry. Two of the championships were not in his era. Never mind. So it's three to four. But all his MVPs came in this era. Jokic is still at 97, but Glenn Rice has joined the team. Okay. So Glenn Rice, who... Uh, was in LA last year, but Orlando for his whole career so far. He's 31 years old, averaged 18 at 3 and 3 last year, but a big boost to this team as Bogues, Manning, Scott, they're all going down. So getting another star could help, and uh, maybe we can get another championship. Chris Weber wins another regular season MVP. Dirk is your rookie of the year. David Robinson. Defensive player of the year, again, Tim Duncan, most improved. And Jokic once again on the All-NBA first team. 27, 11.8 rebounds, 7.7 .7 assists, just dominating. He's a 98 overall right now. Uh, Kobe is on the Vancouver Grizzlies, which was the same team that he was on in our NBA recent from 2K23, which is pretty cool. He averaged 29, 4, and 5. Uh, Tim Duncan on the All-NBA third team, All-Defensive first team. There's Michael with Charlotte now. And he only averaged 24 and 8. He's 36 years old. Gary Payton on the All-Defensive second team. And we are once... Oh, wow. We're the eight seed. Okay. Well, that's, uh, that's a little unfortunate. <laughs> We're the eight seed? I feel like we got better with getting Glenn Rice. All right. Well... Let's see uh, how quickly this ends. Never mind. We're on to round two. We, we beat the number one seed in Miami Heat who had Antoine. I mean, this team isn't really that good. Yeah, I see why we beat them. All right. Well, now we got Washington with the young Tracy McGrady, Sean Bradley. Oh, we should beat this team. We should absolutely beat that team. And we lost in five. Okay. Well, never mind. The Los Angeles Clippers win the finals. Chris Webber with a finals MVP, 26, 9, and 8 in the NBA Finals. Got a new couple of free agents here. Kelgen Murphy and Carlos Williamson. So the team is better. Ooh, we got a young Elton Brand, too, with the 14th overall pick. Okay, well, that helps. Hopefully, he can develop pretty quickly. Uh, Sam Cassell is also on this team. Still don't know if, if we... I mean, this might be... We'll definitely be better than an 8 seed. But I don't know if we'll be able to win a championship. Jokic is 33 years old right now. So we still have like 5 or 6 more years. Well, now the sun is blinding me. So this is awesome. Kevin Garnett wins an MVP 27, 14, and 5. Steve Francis wins Rookie of the Year. John Williams is the 6th Man of the Year. Alonzo Mourning, DPOY. And on to the All-NBA teams. Uh, Jokic is not on the All-NBA first team. Kobe is, though, 29, 5, and 5. Jokic is on the second team, averaging 25, 10, and 7. So his numbers are starting to go down, but it could be because our team was a little bit better this year. And we are the two seed once again. We play the Boston Celtics, and we do beat them in four. Now on to the New York Knicks with Ron Harper, P.J. Brown, Jamal Mashburn. We should win this series, and we do in seven. Oof. All right. Well, now we got the five-seeded Washington Wizards. Kenny Anderson, Tracy McGrady, averaging 19, 6, and 6 in the playoffs. 
And uh, I got Simmons, Bradley, Jalen Rose. This is the team that beat us last year, right? They beat us in game one. They take game two. They take game three. And uh, we'll take game four, but this is over. And the Clippers win back-to-back -back championships. Chris Webber wins another finals MVP. Dang it. Got a bunch of retirements this year. Akeem Olajuwon retires. Isaiah, Karl Malone, Clyde, and Patrick Ewing all retire. Akeem was really good uh, in this. 14-time All-Star, 12-time DPOY. Two-time champion, though. 12-time uh, All-Defensive team. Pretty good. But uh, let's see. Who else? Did anyone else win championships? Clyde. Clyde won one. I forget with who, but uh, I guess with Golden State or maybe Portland. I can't remember which one. Jokic is now starting to regress. He's down to a 96 overall, but Elton Brand went all the way up to an 82. Last season put up 10 and 6, so this is huge. If he can get up to like a 90 and Jokic can sustain over a 90, we might actually have uh, another chance at another championship. Chris Webber wins another MVP. He's now in Chicago, and that's why his fourth MVP, his third. He's a two-time champion, three-time MVP. He's uh, he's dominating right now. Kenny Martin wins Rookie of the Year. John Williams, another six-man Alonzo DPOY. Uh, no Jokic on the first team, but he is on the second team. 24, 11, and 7. Down to a 97 overall. But are we good enough to possibly win again? We are the two seed. So let's get through this round one against the Washington Wizards. And we are eliminated in round one, the what we can't get past so damn wizards. We can't get past the wizards. I don't think we're gonna win another one. The Raptors win a championship. Allen Iverson wins finals MVP 31, 4, and 11. Wow. All right. Well, there you go. Pau Gasol goes number one overall. Arenas goes number two. Did we get some help here? We got Kwame Brown. We got. We got Kwame Brown. All right, looking at the progression, we don't have a lot of players. Uh, Elton Brand's up to an 86 overall. We're, Jokic is down to a 94. We still got Williamson at an 80. Antonio Daniels at a 79. Kwame's a 74. We have a lot of size, but not a lot of shooting. Ah, man. Yeah. Don't think we're going to be good enough this year. The 2002 season is now over, and Chris Webber wins another MVP. He's insane. Uh, what is this? Four? Yeah, it's four MVPs. And he's gone back to back twice. Uh, that's pretty good. Pau Gasol wins rookie of the year. Six man of the year is Gilbert Arenas. Tim Duncan DPOY. Uh, ooh, Jokic is on the first team. Okay. At 36 years old. Nice. Uh, 28, 10, and 7. Pretty good year. I doubt we're very good but he's on the all we're the one seed okay elton brand getting better really helps out oh we have tyron Lou. okay well we play washington again though so this is probably going to be a loss no we did it we finally beat washington now we got the bulls here with gary payton chris weber the mvp Corey mcgetty's on this team this is a good... We're, we're not beating this team. This this is a too good of a team. Yeah. We lose in five. And the Bulls win the NBA championship. 29-11 and 8 from Chris Webber. He's just insanely good in this. Michael Jordan retires at the age of 39. 26 points per game. 5 rebounds. 6 assists. 2 steals and a block. 4-time MVP. 16-time All-Star. 4-time champion. 3-time finals MVP. So he does have one championship uh, more than Jokic, but the same amount of finals MVPs. And I want to say the same amount of regular season MVPs, but I might be wrong. I think Jokic might only have three. But I mean, they're they're pretty close as far as who ended up having a better career. Although I think Michael had better teammates, right? So, you know, Jokic has that over him. Jokic is now down to a 93 overall. Elton Brando is up to an 88. Williamson is up to an 81. Ah, uh, yeah. I mean, it's a solid team, but I don't think it's better than that Chicago team, unfortunately. The 0203 season is now over. Steve Nash wins MVP 30 and 10 a game. Yao Ming wins Rookie of the Year. Gilbert Arena, Sixth Man of the Year. Shaq wins 
DPOY, he's in New Orleans now. He left Seattle. Shaq, all NBA first team. Jokic, still on the all NBA second team. Nearly 25, 9, and 7. Down to a 94 overall at 37 years old. Pau Gasol is on the all NBA third team along with Kobe Bryant. And uh, moving on to the playoffs, we are the two seed once again. So can we get past. Who did we lose to last year? Chicago. Okay, they move on and they play New Orleans. We've got Orlando here with Derek Fisher, Jermaine O'Neal, Lamar Odom's on that team, Jerry Stackhouse. It's a pretty solid team, but we beat them in five. We're on to the conference finals against New Orleans with the MVP, Steve Nash, and Shaq. They're on the same team. That's that's pretty good. With Michael Wright on that team, that's a pretty damn good team. But we win in five, and we're on to the NBA finals. Yes. Jokic. In his 19th year, at 37 years old, is on to the NBA Finals. And this would be his, possibly his fourth NBA championship if they win it. He's only a two-time MVP. Wow, I thought he won three, but I guess not. Three Finals MVPs. Elton Brand's at a 90 overall right now. But we play the Dallas Mavericks, who have Tim Hardaway, Manu Ginobili. They have Marcus Camby. Bonzi Wells, I I feel like we win this game or when we win the series too, but we lose in seven. All right, well the Dallas Mavericks are NBA champions. Manu Ginobili wins MVP, 18 six and six. Yeah, that sucks. We got to another one, but can't get that fourth championship. On to the 2003 NBA draft. LeBron goes two. What? Okay. Interesting. Utah takes Dwayne Wade. Detroit will take LeBron. Melo goes to Portland. Bosch goes to Phoenix. And the Sixers have a pick here. They did, but they, they took a nobody. Jokic is now down to a 91. Brand is up to an 89. Antonio Daniels is up to an 80. It's still a solid team. But now that Jokic is dropping all the way down to 91, I think that was our last chance to uh, to win a championship. Entering year number 20. And uh, yeah, I think, uh, I think that was our last chance. The 2003-2004 season is now over. Gilbert Arenas wins MVP 28 and 7. LeBron wins Rookie of the Year 27, 6 and 5. That's a good start. Two steals and two blocks per game. Elton Brand is the sixth man of the year. Oh, he's coming off the bench. Is he listed as a center? He is. That's why. Maybe we should start him. Move him to power forward. Why is he center? DPOY is Tim Duncan. Jokic is on the all-NBA first team at 38 years old. 25, 10, and nearly 7 assists per game. His shooting percentages have dropped, though. Shaq is on the second team. Uh, no other Sixers in here. And we are the four seed. So not great. We got the New Jersey Nets and we will lose in six. And that will do it for probably Jokic's last year. Seattle wins the championship. Antonio McDice wins finals MVP. And we'll look at retirements here. Did he retire? He did. So that would do it. Nikola Jokic for his career. 25.9 points per game. 10 rebounds, 7.6 assists, a steal, and a block per game. Two-time MVP, 18-time All-Star. Won Sixth Man of the Year his rookie year, I think. Three-time champion, three-time Finals MVP. Nine-time All-NBA first team, seven-time All-NBA second team, two-time All-NBA third team. Never made an All-Defensive team. Was on the All-Rookie first team. And, uh, yeah. It was a pretty damn good career. Uh, his averages 26, 10, and 7. And overall, like, I feel like he didn't have as much help as Jordan and Magic. So, like, they ended up winning more. But I don't know. He was definitely one of the best players, especially right out of the gate. I'm mean, going to what, three straight uh, finals in the first three years? That's. That's pretty damn good. But hope you guys enjoyed. Hit that like button if you did. Subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. And comment down below what other types of these videos do you guys want to see? Even rebuilds or challenges? Let me know in the comments below. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Later, guys.